What's up everybody and welcome back to some more Fallout 76. Today we are going to be doing some exploration in Skyline Valley, any events that may potentially come up, and then possibly do some of the weeklies. We have finished the main storyline for Vault 7, or 63, so there's nothing really more to do there. Maybe we'll talk to some of the companions, or not companions, but NPCs in the area. Maybe we'll go and do some miscellaneous quests and if any of those pop up. I really don't have an exact plan, but we're just going to explore and see what's out there because I didn't really do much of that other than the during the quest. So for now, we'll jump into this. If you guys end up enjoying this, leaving a like on it really helps out a whole lot. This is kind of going to be the style for future uh, streams and stuff. I do have a few other quests that I want to do still. Uh, some main quests, some side things. So probably after... I kind of do some more exploration of this location. Maybe next episode that I do is going to be more of those again. But we'll see. For now, though, uh, we'll just head straight outside and uh, go from there. Here we go. Yeah, my main goal is going to be like any undiscovered locations that I haven't been to. Whoa, what the heck? Oh, huh. I forgot that this is where... This is where we had to go to get all the way out there. I am still using the, what is it, the Goss Rifle. Currently the best one I have still, so... Is there anything inside this building? Like, can I walk around now? Um, this currently is still my go-to, though. And it's it's been alright. I'm not doing as much damage as I would hope to. And maybe I need to work more on my build still. I'm still mainly going for a, like, Rifleman critical build. That's been my main priority. So, um, the Gauss Rifle seems like it was a pretty good gun for it. And then same thing with, I still have my Lever Action Rifle, I think it is. At some point, I wouldn't mind actually trying a, a Black Powder Rifle too, because I've heard those are really good. All right, so here we are, out in the open. Let's see, what is actually around me that I haven't been to yet? We can try going to this, uh, it looks like there's a camp area nearby. I did do, there was like one miscellaneous quest that I was given originally. And I think I knocked that one out, so that's probably why I don't I don't see it anymore on that, but they're fighting each other. I will say that. The boss for this, too, was way tougher than I was expecting it to be. He was, uh, he was rough. Wait, what the heck is that? Oh, it's a mega, hulking mega sloth. I don't think I've ever fought one of those before. And normally they're friendly, but this one's hostile, so... Let's find out. on a few more shots i can't believe how long it actually took me to learn that you can press and hold for the gauss rifle i remember some in one of my like last streams that i did i think it was it might have been during skyline valley or right before it somebody came in and was like dude you can you can hold down to do more damage and i was like wait I, and I'd never realized that the entire time that that's what the uh, the icon meant for like I, I see where it says nine zero zero, and I was like, what is that? That's not your ammo, obviously. So what could that be? Well, turns out that's exactly what it is. It's how much you're holding it down. All right, let's see what we got. It looks like there's like a car area too wait is somebody's camp this looks like somebody's camp 
do. It's not on the map, though. Huh. Oh, this is like a... Like a public camp or something? This is kind of cool. James's note. Hmm. Oh, it's the trading post. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that they had one down here. I saw something moving around. Oh, wow. Yeah, they've got like everything Still here, too. I wonder if my internal clock is Murray. malfunctioning. S salutations. Who are you? Welcome to our li little trading post. How can I, Murray, be of s service today? Uh, what do you sell? Oh, we have an eclectic assortment. Many t traders used to pass through here, you see. Fewer now, but enough to keep our s supplies stocked. We'll hmm. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to skip through that one. Why is this place so deserted? B well, once the weather went bad, we ran into a spot of b bad luck. Whole region became quite the lightning hazard. Though we've been spared any direct hits, most of our camp thought it was time to m move on, I suppose. Except me and Wesley, of course. <laughs> and I'm sh sure James will be back any day now with Ms. Jewel. Uh, I don't know about that. Who's James and Jewel, though? James is our camp leader who stayed behind to keep the place going while the uh, others decided to leave. He eventually left to chase uh, after Miss Jewel. There's okay. something of an item, you see. <laughs> Wesley and I are watching over the place till he returns with her. I'm certain he will be back any day now. Okay. Yeah, I don't know about that. What about Wesley? Who's that? He's our mechanic who stayed back due to for feeling a little under the weather. No worries, though. I keep him supplied with freshly boiled water. But between you and me, he's been a tad bit lazy for some time now. Sleeping in all day and not much for company. Also, my tune-up is w way overdue now. Uh, that's. Uh, ask I think away. that's it. Yeah, that's it. Ta-ta. Ta-ta for now. We've got a bunch of stuff here, though. All right, that's kind of cool. Impact. I'll take oh, one of those. Wesley, if we actually use a rat away. Air resupply. Huh. Yeah, it's awesome. I did not expect there to be this out here. Scrap box. We'll go ahead and store items real quick. All right, what else is nearby? I uh, keep pulling up the wrong thing. Another icon down here, and looks like there's a diner down there too. See, this is a part that I haven't really. Uh, although most of my time in '76 has really been following the storylines, and then sometimes doing some weekly stuff. Um, the only problem I have with doing weekly and daily stuff is I, I wish it would show you the icons on the map, similar to a quest. Um, but instead it just tells you like, oh, go kill this amount of things. And I guess you're supposed to do that while doing other things. If that makes any sense. I don't know. Something about like not like, yes, you can look it up. I can use my second monitor and pull up where I'm supposed to go. But I just wish it was like the weeklies or the dailies were kind of built more as a uh, a quest in a way. That would be kind of cool. I know there are daily quests that you can do. Oh, God. A lot of honey in here, I guess. I'll take it. I haven't really collected a lot of honey myself, but... Oh god, I'm making them mad. You would not find me walking into a place like this. If I saw that many bees hanging around. Diseased glowing honey bees. All those bees gave me like shivers for a second there too. God. 
some gold scrap honey okay are we back in the uh regular area again no this is still part of the expanded all right there's either a house down there or there's the diner uh it looks like the diner is a little closer or whatever it actually is is that a mole rat Yeah, if we come across any, like, I think right now it's blood eagles and blood eagles and uh, miners, mole miners are the two objectives for, for the weekly well, the campsite here. Oh. Something's close. oh, look at that. Blood eagle. <laughs> Oh, would you look at that? How convenient. Nice. Cripple a blood eagle's arm. That was pretty easy. But yeah, the next few streams, or not streams, but videos that I do of this might actually be doing more of the, uh, the quests that I have available again. Oh, God. Wait, I just realized that's a blue devil. <laughs> Is there a random encounter? Oh, I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I've never actually ran into this on the open. Oh god, oh god, okay. You running away? Oh, I forgot that there's no toggle aim. I keep forgetting about that in this game. So I can't seem to cripple his leg. Oh, jeez. Ah, run. We're fine. We're doing fine. Halfway there. The good thing is my my damage, although it's not great, my protection seems to be in check. Like my defenses. Oh, I I can go for his his head. Test your metal. If there's people doing that, I'll I'll go do that. But yeah, I wanted to do some more like right now i would be doing more quests but i just feel i don't know there's part of me that feels bad if i don't go out and do more in skyline valley but the thing is we finished the storyline so like what else would we do other than explore which that's also why I, I said earlier i was like you know what maybe i'll just like see what's here i've never really in, in all the other Fallout games, like in 3 or New Vegas, like if I see a spot that interests me, I go there. And then it, sometimes a quest will pop up and you're like, okay, cool. Let me go do this now. Because this uh, interests me. But I, I will say that's one of the, the shortcomings of 76. Oh, I'm getting destroyed by the blue devil here. Is all the quests that you get pop up instantly? Um, and then I, I feel like it's like kind of easy to run through all of them. I don't know. I, I could be wrong. Maybe there's like, a, it's way longer and way more in depth than I thought, but that's, that's what my goal is going to be like after this one, after we finish all the exploring and stuff, let me go here first and then we'll, uh, there's that lost dweller. 
After this, we'll make our way over to test your metal if that's still going on. I'm gonna discover this first. Slumber Mill Motel. All right, where is it? Is anybody doing it? First of all, yeah, there's some people. Uh, there's at least two. I'll join. You can definitely at least join this and do it. See you in the ring. Or help out well, with this. What Eagles don't understand is that we're not just a team. We're if brethren. If Bloodsaw thinks he can order me to crank out another Brotherhood dozen Scout. Bots, yeah, that's the, the quest line. I, I still need to do Steel Rain, and then, uh, what's the other one? Is it Steel Rain? Steel Dawn, I think it is. It's like Steel Rain and Steel Dawn. Careful where you are the step, two. Outsider. All these Rust Eagle bots have imposing names. It's time we had some of our own. What those Rust Eagles don't understand is that we're not just so I was, I was, of course, we're in the middle of doing that quest line, and then I went on, like, a semi-vacation, and while in the middle of that, they dropped the last second, like, three days in advance, they said, oh, yeah, by the way, the DLC comes out in three days. Uh, or not DLC, but the ex map expansion drop. Uh, yeah, here we are. I want to change my outfit at some point. Too, but I don't know what I would change it to. I have a decent amount of options. I just haven't actually tried any of them. Alright, I think we're just waiting for other people to join. I guess. We can we could do speak to initiate has our backs. Initiate Papa's. To keep us from hauling some of these ruined bots back to Fort Atlas. Amps all about the guns. No appreciation for getting all up close. Beatrice, and the wench. Ra oh, the wrench. <laughs> Just the wench. <laughs> Welcome to the metal dome. Bot Smith Am. Hello there. Take some of that. Don't I mind if I do. Some duct work. tape. This way, I'll be able to defend myself when I become a scribe. How about the ammo box? There isn't any problem that can't be solved with 35% more lasers. Oh. oh. Our house, our rules. Come on. Got it. I am a link in the chain. I will All right, not we got two minutes. I don't know if it tells you that when when it starts on the map. But I, I guess I should check those construction protectrons. beforehand whether it is or isn't. After we're done here, we'll go back above. down to Nobody that Slumber Mill Motel. We can at least explore it. Maybe this thing here. I saw this on the map for a bit, so that might be a good spot. Can't you see I'm I hope appreciates what we're doing. There's another radio tower there, too. Relay tower. Yeah, some of these spots I haven't been to either. Like even down here. Pay attention to your radios. Initiate Papa's will keep us updated from above. All right, I think we're good. I I mean, I don't want to make the call. I don't want to be the one to make the call. What those rust eagles don't understand is that we're not just a team. We're brethren. Careful where but we definitely got a lot of people outside. assembling to do this. That's Every time we go into that ring, we might not get the out more of the line. merrier. Did Amp send someone over here to spy on what I'm making? Well, it won't work. Is that a ready check? All right, I'm gonna start it. Hey, it's good we to see the gladiators are head. Start event. <laughs> That's what I. My teammates are making their preparation. I'll be in contact with you. Welcome back to the Metal Dome, Rust Eagles, Bot Jockeys, and Guests. How did Initiate Papa I'm Bloodsaw, your master of ceremonies for this robot program. All right, here we go. You're about to see the best Rust Eagle war machines take on a team of wasteland warriors in three rounds of brutal combat. Turn your attention to the arena floor and let's introduce our combatants. Now entering the arena is the team you love to hate. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, 
You know what? I know what I'm doing too. Let's do it. Give everybody a party gift. I don't know how close you have to be for that. But I hope it, it gave it to all of them. And sometimes I feel like this game is so loud. That's interesting seeing a, a melee power armor build. Wow. Oh God. I got a little bit too close to those rats. A little too close there. Ouch. Oh, it's a Mr. Killmeister. Ow. Oh my God, they were hurting me. Destroy the golden iBot before the next round. What is happening? Oh, there it is. I saw everybody like attacking something, but I couldn't tell what it exactly it was. Oh, nice outfit. The All right, what do we got? Persuadatron. sure what day I'm gonna upload this but I I'm, I might end up doing like a a fallout Friday type thing that might be the go-to for future videos uh, since I, I was doing this on live streams originally but I think now well uh, since I'm playing a lot of other stuff on stream we'll start doing these as uh, videos and I think fallout Friday which is what I was originally doing uh, for my playthroughs would be a good go-to. So that's the current plan. Um, I'll try to record a few of these in throughout, like maybe at least once or twice a week. I mean, it could, I could also publish more videos, not just on Fridays, but, uh, hopefully I'll try to get at least one out Fridays for fallout. What else we got here? Five seconds for the you final round. Bad, the How the fast are we going to get through down. this final round? Hell, I'm ready. Nice. I'll definitely be starting a ghoul playthrough closer to when they, they have the ghouls uh, coming out. Because that's supposed to be early 2025, and it's going to change up your whole build. So I wonder if they're going to have, like, new skills. That one will probably be, probably be my commando playthrough rather than um, right now where I'm playing with the... Oh. Rifleman instead. Is the Grimbot? Once again, the gladiators of Steel Triumph fall in and left that back to base. Beautiful. Woo. Oh. Let's go ahead and take all. Not too bad. 
Mutant Slayer's Ultra Sight Gatling Laser. These. Nocturnal Golf Club. Grab everything over here. Assassin's Bone Club. Probably drop all those for a legendary script. It would be nice. I probably could make it or craft a ton of uh, these parts. I could probably craft a ton of Gauss Reaper's rifles Reaper. and then uh, the use them. If See if I can get a better one than my aristocrat right now. Bot. I'm actually going to go to the trading post and use the script machine there. But yeah, that would be kind of cool, actually. Now that I'm thinking of that. I haven't crafted any in a while. I actually saw a video. I can't remember the, the creator's name. Like when I was looking into Fallout tips and stuff. And there was a video where somebody, he made 30, I think it was. It was about 30 different, uh... I know I have the radium rifle on me. That's what it was. Not the lever action. The chicken. He made 30 different, Looks like, like 45 guns, again. and they all did, uh, batch for when he wakes up. like, he crafted them, and then he used the legendary script on seeing what mods he would get for it. It was kind of a cool video. He, it was a decent amount, and he, he would review it and say, like, okay, yeah, this would be a good one for this build. Okay, this one I wouldn't use it, but it still could be fine. It was cool to see, though. We'll break all these down. Fine. Cool. We actually throw it all into this. And then we can go down back down to that, that slumber mill area because there were some enemies there and then there was a few other uh locations like indoors that we can probably go check out. So we'll do that in just a sec. Alright, we're traveling over there. Fast travel. I think it's because the uh, the chickens are nearby. So it's like, oh, you gotta you gotta wait a second. They're considered enemies, although they weren't attacking, which is kind of funny. But yeah, I'm kind of uh, now that I'm like thinking about it, I feel like this is gonna be the perfect type of. Because these episodes, since it's not a live stream, they're going to be about an, about an hour-ish. Sometimes it'll be a little bit less. Sometimes it'll be maybe a little more, um, depending on where we're at. But I feel like that would be perfect for doing a series where we continue on and do, like, all the quests. Do the, the official, like, side quests, the main story quests. Because um, over time, I mean... That's going to take you all over the map. And that's something I, I, uh, I don't know. Some, I think it could actually be a good time. I don't know how many people or if there's even a way to do every single quest in 76. I know some are repeatable. And there's a lot of dailies that pop up. So you could always do those too, but... I also wonder how many people actually end up doing the uh, the actual daily quests. Not just the daily objectives for the season, but the daily quests that you have to go and like talk to somebody and for foundation or for the, the raiders or whoever it may be. These things, the ones right here. There's a lot of them that pop up too. And some of them aren't even like, yeah, like this one, playtime. i return to Chloe. Hit level 108, not bad. I've been saving a lot of my levels for cards and stuff. Cause right now I don't really have a plan on what I need right this second. Is there anything cool in here? Okay. Nothing really special there. Oh, 
office fan. Okay. Alright, what do we got here? Collect those. Does this red smoke meet anything? Oh, right. When I fast traveled, we went to this spot. But I did not go over here. Save us. I've seen those before. Dog. Lost heavy engineer, automatic handmade. Forty five that gunpowder. Government aid airdrop. Unlock inaccessible. Okay. Oh god. That one came out of nowhere. I swear, the amount of times that ghouls show up randomly and scare the hell out of you. Oh, yeah, there's a... I saw... Let me eat these. I think one of the weekly objective is to eat free war food. I'm just going to eat all of them. Yum, yum, yum. Is a rifle? Here, I'll, I'll take it. Just because. Alright, I think we're good here. What else is out there? There's a factory down there. And then there's also a... Starlight Creeper. There's like a house or a tower. Outpost, maybe. To the northwest. So let's go west this way. Diseased mole rat. Oh. Disappeared. I pulled down my uh my camp here for a second. Go. How am I doing on well rested? Do we have it still? Uh, very well rested. Okay, nice. What is that? A legendary toxic thrasher. I killed the first one in one hit. Turkeys, man. <laughs> Wait, did I kill the first one or did I kill... I oh, know I did get it. Yes. It's a plasma pistol, though. I saw that, like, a plasma rifle could be really good for this build, too. But, yeah, it's a medic plasma pistol. How do I have well tuned for seven more minutes? I'll go ahead and play the banjo real quick. And do that. And I'm just going to do this real quick. Nice. 
We are good there. Uh, I'll hold on to the items I just picked up. Keep going to the factory. Oh, it actually is kind of a factory. What is this? Oh. Oh, is it the mole miners here? Ooh, that'd be perfect. Big metal gas. Okay, sick. I mean, we're definitely not going to get 30 in this, but <laughs> I could try going different areas. But it's good to know for the future. Oh my god, there's so many. Sh like, jeez, man. What is that? Oh, another one of those thrashers. And I'm being I'm being attacked by three different things at once. The mole miners, thrasher, a mole rat, and rockets. Definitely feel like maybe we're doing a little better now, though. Is that what? I think enemies, the highest they go up to is 100. So at 108, like we're still, we're still leveling up. I don't know if your health still increases over level 50 and stuff. I'm assuming there's some sort of effect. Because at 150, you, you got to be like pretty strong. And I do get some two shots here and there. It just depends on uh, on what I'm at, uh, facing. Is it safe here? We can open. Nice. Would you look at that? Hey. All right. Anything else? Yeah, we're pretty much on the edge of the map right now anyways, so... Alright, cool. Let's go to this little tower or whatever it is down here. My gun away. Take a rat. Oh, shoot. I took a rat X. Oh. I did not mean to take a rat X. Because Rad X, uh, I think, reduces my... My effects. Yeah, I don't have my running boost or jump. Crap. That's okay. It doesn't. They don't last for like that long. But still. Of course, I'm over encumbered right now. It's probably because I have those missiles on me that I just picked up. Um, all right. Do we have any plans to learn? I do. Okay. Nice. Had a few of them. Elegant couches. You already know electrified. Man, I forgot what the movement is like without <laughs> having your mutations. That's something else. Rapid, Rapidan camp. We got here. Now the team leader. I'm 
another safe in here. Uh, Iguana on a stick. Are you hostile? Oh, no, you're friendly. Mr. Protect Gardener answer. Supervisor. Is that a player camp up there? <sighs> no, it just must be... Huh. Every time I see... And maybe it's, it's just me, but every time I see a cabin, like with this, this look in front of it... Oh, the brown house. Go inside. Um, it, it always reminds me of like walking the walking dead telltale season two. That's what it makes me think of the bobblehead leader. Okay. Federalist desk. What is this guy? Uh, oh, hello there. Welcome to Rapidan camp. The president's home away from home. Oh, that's cool. What is this place? You're at Rapidan Camp in Shenandoah National Park. Do you know what's going, been going on with the weather? It all started with that ruckus from the Dark Hollow Manor, you see. Oh, I do hope that they're all right. Hmm. They are in the thick of it, after all. But uh, according to my colleague Hemsworth, the garden is in complete chaos. This uh, brings me a lot of okay. joy, as I've always felt that his garden was pretty tacky and didn't deserve all those gala awards. Whoa. I always believed the man was clearly overcompensating for something. If you catch my <laughs> drift, reason. Okay, Gumley. Now our beautiful flowers are wilting, and I'd hate to have to resort to... to... plastic! Not... Plastic. I have some questions about Rapid End Camp. Oh, goody. I do love answering questions about President Hoover's home away from home. It's been years since I've had anyone ask. Oh, uh, well, well, I'll help you out here. The president's home away from home? Well, yes. President Hoover and his wife, Lou Hoover, built Rapid End Camp. They oh, used cool. the grounds as their presidential retreat throughout his administration. When his term came to an end, President Hoover donated Rapidan Camp to the executive wing of the government. So future presidents could continue to use the camp and enjoy the natural beauty of Shenandoah National Park. Sometimes huh. our presidents still stay here, but one hasn't visited in quite some time. From what I can yeah. remember, some under-secretaries were stationed here on that eventful day, but I haven't seen them for some time now. Who was President Hoover? Herbert Hoover was the 31st President of the United States of America. Would you like to know more about President Hoover? Of course you would! Oh. How silly of <laughs> me to think otherwise. After capably serving as Secretary of Commerce under Presidents Harding and Coolidge, Hoover became a presidential nominee in 1928. you tell me more about President Hoover? Well, of course I can. He's a pretty interesting fellow. On March 4th, 1929, Herbert Hoover was sworn in as the 31st president of the United States of America. Okay. You tell me something else? Certainly. I would like nothing more. Anything in particular? Why do you call why do you care about the flowers so much? Well, maintaining the flora here at Rapidan Camp isn't about just the aesthetics. Yeah. These flowers provide me and any guests a sense of normality in this chaotic world. Besides, a well-tended garden does wonders for the guests' mental health and well-being. That's something in short supply out here. <laughs> okay. What is it you do around here? Well, I'm Gumley, the supervisor here. But as you can see... My colleagues aren't the friendliest bunch. I try to keep the grounds in tip-top condition. Yep. But ever since we ran out of fertilizer, 
the sky changed color, it's almost impossible to do so. I'm so sorry, Gumbly. Ta-ta, friend. Take care now. Remember, if you need anything, I'm here to help. All right. Well, I mean, President Hooper had a lot of board games, it looks like. I see some hanging out on the shelves. What else do we got here? Oh, yeah. Speaking of board games, uh, so I ran a poll recently just to, like, kind of gauge some interest whether people play board games or not, like, for my audience. And, uh... With that, I actually did an, an opening of the Commander deck for Magic the Gathering because they have four, there's four versions of Commander deck that are Fallout themed. And it was actually, it just like was perfect timing because why not? Oh, wow. The undamaged American flag. If he's good enough for Lindy, he's good enough for me. If he's good enough for Lindy, <laughs> he's good enough for me. So it was kind of cool. Um, I really have just been getting into magic very slowly, but it was a lot of fun uh, opening it up, see, recognizing some characters. The one that I got I has Dogme and Preston and Garvey, Cap. and it's all about building up your settlements. Security Who would have thought? <laughs> And some areas uh, are making your limits. team better with that. Hold on, is this? These go into other rooms. Oh, okay. Kitchen. And then there's also another one that's oh, like no. Hail Caesar. And it's all about either using legend or not legendary. It's all about uh, using the like Caesar's Legion or the NCR, which is really cool. Both are magic decks that you can actually play um but yeah i figured I'd, I'd check that out and i put up the first one went up on uh on monday so i might be doing the magic mondays and fallout fridays that might be the plan what else do we got here um let's actually go back over to the hollow manor real quick we'll go to the interior all oh, right i can't fast travel How about if I put this down? I should be able to put this down and then uh, reduce my my over encumbered status. Come on. God. Got it. Rival tent, come on, where's it at? Where are you going? There it is. Oh no, I just junk in here by accident. Hold on, I gotta clear that out now. The worst. <sighs> yes. Nice. Now we're not over encumbered. And my Radex should be running off running out soon, so we'll be alright. Um Let me go back over to the trading post actually. Cause I wanna hand in these um I wanna use the legendary script machine again. To get rid of the, the items that I just got that I'm not really gonna use. It's the chickens again. Anti-armor, bone hammer, and medic's short plasma pistol. Replenish 15 action points with each kill. Vats criticals will heal you and your group. There's no way for me to turn that into a rifle, right? Right? I don't think you can. I think it's stuck as a pistol but wait what the heck oh i forgot that i oh my god i forgot that i have weapons on me too jeez that's what's weighing me down so i was like wait why am i still over encumbered so much 
Oh wait, did I just get rid of it? Oh, no, no. Sorry, I'm all I'm all over the place right now. All right, standard. Would it be like barrel? Does this change it into a rifle? If I use the sniper barrel? Oh, it does change it into a rifle. Hold on now. No way. Hold on now. Do you really want to play? Dun, dun, dun. Uh, okay. Hold. Wait a minute. Wait, this could actually be sick, though. Uh, I gotta do the, the stock first. Let me equip the... Go to this. I need to equip science one, which I do have. Change scrapper to science. Modify. I did not know that you could actually modify this. I was about to get rid of it. All right, standard grip. We're going to change over to... Oh, it's science expert. Dude. It's Luckily, it's only rank one, though. Still. Science. Science expert. Now we go modify. Grip. Aligned stock. I think we'll do that one. Yeah. It's better. So now it's a rifle. And I, I it's nice that the name actually indicates that. Okay. So whoops. Keeps going down, that's why. Barrel. Yeah, I think our best bet although the thing that sucks I mean I could I could leave it as a short barrel. The biggest problem, I mean this uses well now I'm gonna do sniper barrel and the reason I'm doing this is because Vats criticals will heal you in the group and you replenish 15 action points with each kill. So potentially that could be really good. I wonder if I can make a plasma rifle. Vats accuracy. I could do a true capacitor and it just increases the Vats accuracy by a tiny. Vicious. Critical damage. Hip fire accuracy. Doesn't really indicate that though. Let's do that. Sure. All right. I'm kind of excited to use this gun now. Or I'd at least try it. I mean, if it ends up not being good, then whatever, I'll trade it in. But still, kind of excited. I can reduce the reflex. Uh, or the AP cost. Boom. Looks like he let his water go stale again. Okay, let's change. I'll just boil up another batch We're going to equip when that there, up. actually. The medics, marksman, plasma rifle. And I would need more ammo for it, but still. Cool. I'm excited to try that out. Now that I now that I know that you can change plasma pistols. Oh god, this guy's one. Oh, you can change plasma pistols into plasma After all the work rifles. James put into keeping I wish I knew that earlier, going. but what have you? I, did, I guess I just never tried it. So keep that in the back of my mind. Go back to my camp real fast. Maybe grab, yeah, we'll drop any additional ammo that I don't need. And then grab any uh, of the current ammo that I have. Okay, let me check these. From your chains. Let's 
surprising when it actually lets you harvest really there too. Need to clean up around here. And let me swap my skills again. Get rid of science expert. Put scrapper back on. This unit will not rest Scrap again. until this land beats nice. the crimson. Nice. Completed Red another objective. Rank seventeen. Drop those. What kind of ammo does this use? Plasma cart, uh, cartridge, cartridge, cartilage. I have a decent amount of it. I'll take 115. Honestly. Vampire radium rifle. Keep forgetting how good this could be. If I threw on ricochet with this gun it actually could be a lot better um this do i have any way of helping the damage on it only to imperialism. i'm just getting used by somebody See else the lies, right. Fight for the party. let me just see prime receiver yeah i don't i don't have enough radium rifle um if those raiders come snooping around, they're gonna regret it. Items. That's accuracy. It actually goes down with the longer barrel. That's surprising. Watch out. You never know when a raider might attack. Yeah, I barely have, like, any. Ooh, that's accuracy goes up by a lot here. We are the collective. We are the party. I'll hold on to it we for right now. All right, well, that is actually going to be it for this video. Uh, we're going to chill here. Next time, I think we'll go back to doing this storyline. So um, we'll probably do Steel Dawn and then Steel Rain after. I think that's the two names. Um, and then we'll keep it going. So for now, thank you this all for watching. If you guys have any potential. suggestions or things to do for the next episode, feel free to let me know too. I'm not, It's not out of the question. Um, but keep an eye out for Fallout Friday episodes. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.